In this video, we will find why astronauts returning from the space cannot immediately walk properly and are placed in wheelchairs for a while. Stay with us. NASA has been sending scientists into space for research purposes since 1961. Space exploration has contributed greatly to scientific literature, technological innovations, communication, and answers to many fundamental questions about the history of the universe and our place in the space. Astronauts travel in space to bring that valuable knowledge to humans, but the space travel is not easy and comes at a cost. Astronauts may have to face many problems while traveling in space like weightlessness, balance disorder, and some changes in the immune system. You may have noticed that astronauts are placed in wheelchairs after they land on Earth. Why is that so? Our leg muscles and bones are designed to support the weight of the body. As we walk on the ground, these muscles easily bear weight of our body because they are used to it and spend most of the time working. Since there is no gravity in the space, our body becomes weightless. This weightlessness makes some changes in the human body. Due to the absence of gravity, the muscles are no longer required to support the weight of the body or maintain the body posture, so they become lazy and weak. When an astronaut returns to the Earth, he finds it hard to stand on his feet and walk. Various exercises are designed to prevent muscle atrophy due to weightlessness, but an astronaut's legs are not able to bear weight for a time immediately after returning to Earth. The situation worsens if they spend longer in space. An astronaut can be five times heavier than his usual body mass. Therefore, they are placed on wheelchairs after landing and are not recommended to walk three to four days before they could recover as it may cause injuries to them. 